Greg, Hi. 80 years in the business for Sennheiser and mm -hmm. you guys are still doing something new. Sennheiser's moved to the cloud. Tell me more about mm -hmm. that. Yeah, so we're, work, we're announcing our new cloud-based solution for monitoring our devices online. Right now, currently, if you want to monitor your Sennheiser inventory, control cockpit is the way to do that, but it's very location-based, it's very on-prem. So with our new cloud-based solution, you should be able to monitor your entire inventory remotely and see everything, no matter how large or small your campus is, just from a single point of contact. Yeah, it's an extremely smart move. It kind of like sets you up for the future where yeah. AI, data lakes, data processing, data yes. sets, and all of those things are going to become extremely important. Absolutely. We're definitely using AI currently in some of our products, but we definitely have plans on the roadmap to fold AI in not only to products directly, but also in the web experience and the user experience and in, in the monitoring experience. Let's jump to meeting spaces today, and what I'm seeing is this kind of like use a preference for BYOD in mm -hmm. certain circumstances mm -hmm. and you know Teams room, Zoom room specific UCVC requirements. Mm -hmm. How are you thinking about this? How Sennheiser kind of tackles uh, it? Sennheiser's very aware of, of the Zoom and, and the, the MTR situations right now. All of our Team Connect products are Zoom certified and Team certified and given various spaces. They all work very well for inter operability between themselves, but also with a lot of our alliance partners, with the QSIS, with the Crestron, with, with, with all the big players in the room. Uh, in terms of BYOD, uh, the TC Bar, definitely the most BYOD friendly device. It's just a single connection point over USB-C between the device and the compute, and that will also tie you into a larger system. And in your opinion, do you think that extending the hand of friendship and building these bridges with all these ventures to get that interoperability that is the way forward to follow no the consumer. No question, absolutely no question, right? We make microphones, we make endpoints. Like, you don't have a whole system without these alliance partners. So the relationships that we forged with them and continue to form with them is absolutely how we're able to develop an entire ecosystem around Sennheiser products. Greg, thank you so much for your time. Of course.